whether it's uh, too soon for Christmas <laughs> decorations, but the Toledo Botanical Garden is already preparing for next spring. Meteorologist Derek Witt shares some of the garden's good practices in this week's Metro Parks Meetup. November is not the time of year we typically associate with gardening and pretty flowers, but the work you do today can help really maximize the beauty next spring. Finish all of your fall planting of those new trees, shrubs, perennials, even your spring blooming bulbs, because you want to allow those new plants to develop some additional roots before the ground freezes solid. That typically happens in late December, and it takes plants about six weeks to develop more solid roots. Therefore, acting now can help your new plants survive the winter, especially the freeze-thaw cycle. That actually causes the soil to move slightly, and that can actually move your perennials and heave them up out of the soil, which then can expose those tender roots um, to the extreme winter conditions. It's also a good time of year to do some trimming and pruning. Now that the leaves have fallen off of your trees and shrubs, uh, you can make better decisions on what branches to prune out, what branches to keep to make it to that overall shape and form you're looking for. That will save a lot of work come the spring because we're busy enough planting and mulching that time of year. Here's some work you don't have to do. Leave plants that have fruiting bodies or seed pods. They're a critical source of food for wildlife in the winter. Lastly, be sure to enjoy this autumn season, whether it's jumping in a big pile of leaves at home or right here at Toledo Botanical Gardens. Here at the Botanical Garden, we don't permit dogs with our plant collections. So this is a clean and safe uh, pile uh, to enjoy, safe from any uh, dog droppings. With this week's Metro Parks Meetup, I'm Derek Witt. I was pausing to see if he was going to do anything yeah, you know, out of the absolutely. pile again. <laughs> I loved it. Good job, D.